Hey, um, just a real quick, um, I wanted to submit, I'm a little nervous about this because it's my first time submitting something for one of these um, model submission things. Um, you know, I may be late, I don't remember the date on it, but I was inspired to do something different. Um, so Ringo, I think it was Ringo that started the, the Teen Tiger thing, or maybe it wasn't Ringo, Wh whoever it was, I'm sorry, not remembering, sorry. Um, I wanted to um, d uh, do a King Tiger 2, because you guys were all doing one, and I was inspired. So I it's taken me quite a while to do this one, but um, and I, I hope you guys are okay. And get, please give me honest feedback on it so I can get better next time. But um, here's my, um, my King Tiger for the submission, and I, I hope it meets all your... Um, your, um, you know, requirements and all that. So here it is. It's my King Tiger. I, am, I spent a lot of time uh, searching for the module from lock and load for not one step back, the Russian module. Um, and, uh, and then I bought it from a guy all the way in Canada. No, not Gun Barrel. There are other people that live there. His name's Mark. Thanks, Mark. And um, <clears throat> I finally um, told him, yeah, I was ready. So I, I, I used um, 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 a, some, a PayPal and said send, and it went, and he, he sent it to me, and I got it. So I'm pretty proud of myself. I didn't look at the good camo work I did. So this is Lock and Load. Um, not one step back. It's a, a squad-level board game, the Band of Heroes. And if you look here, you can see it's got good paint. It's a King Tiger. It can carry two, um, two teams of people, and so they ride out on the, in the open. It's got an eight armor front hull, six um, on the turret, uh, four side and five on the side on the turret, and a four in the back and the four in the back of the turret. It's got a six morale. It goes seven hexes on track. The four is the HE, so the high explosive equivalent of the main gun, a big main gun. And the four is the machine gun that is probably, I'm assuming, in the bow. So it's four. And then if you flip it over, um, if you shoot zero to eight, it, you can you just need to roll under a ten to hit the person or the tank. And then you roll that, that eight is your um, armor penetration. So you roll a die. And here's a T-34 that I put together. Um, pretty good, I thought. And so if you look at the T-34, so the eight, you'd roll a D-6, so you average about three. And so that'd be 11. And then let's say you hit him on the front and you were, uh, hit a th roll to 3 or even a 4, it'd be 9. So 11 minus 9 would be 2. And then you roll another die to see, um, well, the, the vehicle's destroyed at that point, um, I believe. Anyway, I, I haven't used armor a whole lot. So and that's how that works. And that's my King Tiger for the submission of the thing. And thanks for letting me participate. And I hope I win the big prize. Oh, wait, was there a prize? Oh, I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Goodbye.